This trick here is the fastest way to find the inverse of 3 cross 3 order matrix. No need of cofactors or adjoint. Finding inverse of a 3 cross 3 order matrix takes forever, right? What if I told you there is a math sort trick that can solve it in no time. Just one technique and few steps, you'll flip that matrix like a pro. The name of this trick is mirror matrix method. What we do here is simply rewrite the row 1 and row 2 later followed by column 1 and column 2 making it a 5 cross 5 order matrix and later we do cross multiplication. Let me show this to you with help of an example. Here in the question given to us, they have given a matrix which is non-singular in nature because determinant is non-zero and given equal to 1. Okay, and we are asked to find inverse of the matrix. Let's try solving now. The matrix given to us in the question is this one 3 cross 3. We'll make it by writing the row and column again in the order 5 cross 5. Write the first row we have 1, 2, minus 2. Second row we have minus 1, 3 and 0. Again first column we get 1, minus 1, 0, 1 and minus 1. Second column from here will give me, what is it? 2, 3, minus 2, 2 and 3. Now next step is to eliminate the first row and first column of this so obtained 5 cross 5 matrix. First row is eliminated with first column. Okay, let's find the formula that we have for A inverse given by adjoint of A divided by determinant of A. Determinant of A in this question is simply given as 1. Simply given as 1. It means my A inverse is going to be equal to adjoint of A. And this technique is to find the adjoint directly without finding cofactors. Next, we are going to find determinant of these 2 cross 2 order matrix in given columns and write in the row of these A inverse which is nothing but adjoint. Okay, have a look. 3 into 1 is 3 minus 2 into 0 which is 0. Answer is simply 3. Next we get minus 2 into minus 2 is 4 and we have 2 into 1 which is 2. Subtraction is 2. Last one 2 into 0 is 0 and we have 3 into minus 2 is minus 6. Subtraction makes positive so plus 6. So you go down in the column and get the answer for the row. And last we have to do this column. Okay. Minus 1 into minus 2 is plus 2 and 3 into 0 is 3, sorry 3 into 0 is 0, we get 2 over here. 0 into 2 is 0, 1 into minus 2 gives me, again minus 2, subtraction make it positive, so plus 2 here. And last one, 1 into 3 is 3 and subtraction of 2 into minus 1, minus 2 makes it plus 2, answer is 5 over here. This is my final answer for inverse 3, 2, 6, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2, 5. Isn't that easy? This is my final answer for inverse. See?